Hello world, my name is Rodrigo, I'm the author of this gamification system called Ajogada, and in this video is to show you how you're gonna use our free game kit for managing your business or personal projects with two very simple and open tools, a modeling canvas and a online balance sheet. The meaning of the word Jogada in Brazilian Portuguese means a leap that works as a game changer event. A movement that turns the table of the game and suddenly inverts the situation of a problem. It's a word very used on soccer, but also used in the business world. So, a jogada is the name of this technique that contains algorithms from project management and agile management philosophies inside a disruptive interface that can be easily printed or drawn in any surface to help you structuring projects with holistic vision to detect blind spots and preventing losses with prolonged trial and error cycles in, de in developing a solution. Save this video because I bet with you these tools will make you more money than any other tool in your life or office, like your computer, cell phone, car, because it's the only tool that will help you to use all the other tools with strategy. So this is our 4D valuation balance sheet, designed to help you structure the valuation of any type of traditional or creative business. How to evaluate companies like game studios or design agencies. The same way you make the valuation of a farm or, or a restaurant, so this balance sheet will help you to see that, but distributing the data from your cash flow in different layers, taking commercial, operational, tactical, strategic and existential layers of management and putting in perspective with your current revenue, with your current beta, your current valuation and your current stage of evolution in comparison to your five-year long-term goal of valuation, giving you perspective of how much, how much you have to be selling and profiting with a, a, with a hypothetical product to be able to have a massive revenue supporting a massive valuation that will in the end rank your business going from a food, tr food truck between zero and 100,000 into a restaurant from 100 to 1 million to store from 1 million to 10 million for, to a supermarket from 10 million to 100 million from 100 million to a billion in your shopping mall until you become the legendary unicorn. But together with this incredible spreadsheet, there is also an incredible mandala shaped board game that you can print and use as you wish that works like a 4D Excel that will help you to you to see your assets with the right side of your brain being able to make more creative links between them but when you have both things together you're gonna feel that you have more brilliant ideas that will make you feel very excited and energized all the time to the point it can be sometimes dangerous because makes we feel you can work stoplessly without never getting tired because you create such dopamine flow that it gives this endless energy sensation so remember to enjoy well your contemplation breaks because they are when we effectively learn and thus we evolve if we don't do that we keep repeating the same mistakes so speaking about contemplation I will show you how to make an omelette using the board and crossing it with something called Hero's Journey. But to prove the concept, I will narrate it 
as a quest of you inventing a omelet specialized business that later becomes a franchise. So one day you come home at 3 a.m. from a party, but you feel hungry. So you go in front of the fridge and open the door. That starts the contemplation phase, element water. You look at the fridge and see that you have eggs, one tomato and some cheese. What could you do with it? So, in many possibilities and forms of preparation, you decide that the best way for cooking is making an omelette. Then, once you decide to make it, there is a specific kind of magic step that puts a landmark that, when crossed, can't come backwards. This landmark is breaking the egg. Once you break it, you can't come back anymore without paying the price of losing. This is like doing a contract with nature that creates a penalty for those who give up or abandon their goals in the middle. That starts the preparation phase from the element earth. So after breaking the mixing the egg with little pieces of tomatoes and cheese and, set, and setting them up on the stove, there is another landmark that poses a point of no return. Lighting up the fire will change the molecular structure of the substance and it can never come back then, especially if you let it too long in the fire. So that starts the element fire and during this process of moving it and mixing it to cook well, the cook puts all its talent and signature when timing the stop of the fire the trigger that ends the action and starts a new contemplation with the appreciation of the preparation. On this contemplation phase, you can stop your mind to be able to feel again, obtaining new information that will be used for improving your preparation process for the next time you make this omelet. So now imagine that two days later, you feel again the will to eat that preparation you like. And after the end of the process, this time you think that you have found a perfect formula for making it tasty and juicy, but also crocky. So you start that what could become a successful business, specializing seven types of ingredients in different preparations of omelets. Then you start researching for possible good places for this business or buying a food truck. Renting a store or buying the truck can be your point of engage. Then after setting up and running your business as a omelette assembly line, you figure out you have created a efficient process and the product is good because it's tasty, cheap and help. So you start thinking that this could easily be a franchise. So you start projecting its possible valuation in the year five, learning about the omelet world market and look for a lawyer specialized in franchises to learn how can you open your business for investors and franchises for being able to enter the business. You start learning how to set up a franchise owner's manual and instructions of supply chain and team management. And you hire a marketing agency to prepare a VIPs event for investors directed to people of the state's franchise association. So you present your numbers explaining how giant can be the omelet market in a healthy substitution of Hamburgers based on data about the stagnation of hamburger industry because of the negative marketing of being responsible for fires on the Amazon forest. You explain your contract and raise so much capital that you just become instantly richer. You just went from a food truck to a store and you became 100 times richer. So people, that is what a Jogada game does. Thanks for watching this video and check our free course on personal finance gamification and join our training clubs if you want me to help you on your setup.
just check up ajogada.org slash en. Bye-bye.